Hey, what's up, everybody? GamerPro8000 here, and welcome back to another reaction about SML. And today, I'm going to reacting to their oldest video, and that happens to be Junior Broken Lake. Oh, man. Yep, I did not forget about the remake about this. Yep, I remember the remake. I did not forget that Junior literally just doing too much, but Haunt the Horn... So freaking much that it's literally getting Chef PP a headache. Yeah, he did so much that he decided to fake his injury in the end. And you know what happened? He got broken leg. He literally got another broken leg. It's not on the, it's not on the same leg. It's on the other one. Because he got karma. Because he deserves it. He was a fucking asshole. And he's, and he's going to be in this video. Yep. Great, I can't wait to see this. If all you remember correctly, that's what Junior has done. He got everything he wanted and then fake his injury in the end. So I'm, I'm going to see the same thing in this video. Yep. If I were Junior, I would not fake my injury. I would wait a longer while, as long as I could, for my, for my legs to heal up or any else in my body part to heal up. Then I will be absolutely better. I will get on to my life and not try to send a couch all day with a broken body part. Yeah, seriously. I know sitting down in the couch or anywhere else is relaxing for you, but that doesn't mean you gotta go faking your injury, telling them a lie, and saying that you're not feeling better. Like, come on, it's like being face sick to not go to school or not to go to the dentist or anything else at all. Yep. But yeah, I will not do that. I will wait for myself, for my body to heal up. That way, I can go and enjoy myself, enjoy having fun out there. Yeah, I will love that very much. Alright, anyway, before I get straight into this video, I just need everyone to do me a huge favor and not see my like in this video. And most importantly, subscribe to this channel. Also, don't forget to hit the bell while you're at it. If everyone did all of that, thank you so much. I will always appreciate that. Now let's get straight into this bill and see how this goes. Oh man, I finally get to take a break after all that cooking and cleaning. Now I get to sit back and relax. Hey, Chef BB! No, Junior, I don't feel like talking right now. I'm trying to take a 30 second break. 30 second break? Why don't you take a 30 minute break and take me and my friends to the park? To the park? No, Junior! There's a bunch of mosquitoes outside and it's hot. I don't want to go to the park. But, Chef BB, it's summer and we're kids. We want to play outside. Well, it would be more relaxing to go outside than to wash dishes downstairs. Uh, I guess I'll take you. Oh, you, you'll take us? Yeah, yeah, I t I'll take you. Come on. All right, guys, we're going to the park. Yeah. Oh, my God, we're at the park, Chef BB. I know. I drove you here. Look, go and play on the playground. Do your thing. I'm going to go and sit down on the bench. Look, I only came for the fresh air. Come on, guys. Let's play on the jungle gym. Yeah. Whoa, Joseph, look how big this rock wall is. I know, dude. It's huge. I bet I can beat you to the top. No. -uh. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, it's cheating. No, it's not. <laughs> I made it to the top, everybody! Hey, Junior. What, Patrick, you're here? Yeah, my mom dropped me off a few days ago, and she still hasn't come back. <laughs> what, you're missing a shoe? Oh, yeah, some crazy dog took it. Oh. Well, Joseph, I made it to the top! <laughs> ha ha, I beat you to the top, Joseph. No, on, dude, you cheated. How'd I cheat? You pushed me down, it's not fair. No, you're just too slow, and I'm the champion. Okay, then race me down the ladder. Well, that ladder's really curvy, what if I fall? Ooh, you scared, huh? I'm not scared, I'll beat you down there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong, Junior? I think I broke my leg. Oh, you didn't break your leg. Just walk it off. It's bent behind me. Shit, baby, take me to the hospital. Huh, come on, let's go. Ow, my leg hurts so bad. Well, that's because your leg's broken. Uh, it's broken? Well, yeah, that's why there's a cast on it. And if you look at this little tiny x-ray, you'll see a little fracture right there on your shin. Whoa, Shit, baby, I broke my leg. Wow, I can't believe you broke your leg at a playground. What, are your balls made of paper? Uh, doctor, how long is it going to be broken for? I'd say probably about three weeks. Three weeks? But the soccer team tryouts are tomorrow. Junior, you never played soccer ever in your life. What are you talking about? He's right. I'm lying. 
Yeah, well, I would just recommend you sit here on the couch and you don't try to walk on it or run or anything because you don't want to break it even more. Well, I sit down for like three weeks. Well, well, how am I supposed to get the stuff I need? Well, see, that's the good thing about having a broken leg is that people will get it for you because they feel bad for you. Wait, really? People do whatever I say? Yeah, I mean, don't take advantage of it. You know, don't be a dick, but yeah. Oh, people will do whatever I want. Hey, Junior. Oh, hey, guys. How's the leg, dude? Yeah, that was a pretty bad fall. Guys, it's broken. What, broken? Like, in half? Yeah, I can't walk on it for like three weeks. Oh, that sucks, dude. Yeah, we brought you flowers. Yeah, hope you feel better, dude. Flowers? Yeah. That's gay. What? It was Cody's idea. Well, we were just trying to help. But what are flowers supposed to do? Like, oh, oh, I got flowers. My leg's not broken. I feel better. But don't be a dick, Junior. We were just trying to be nice. Well, no, why didn't you give me, like, a new video game or something cool? Well, we don't have a lot of money. How much does flowers cost? Five dollars. Each? Yeah. That's like ten dollars. You could got me, like, gummy worms, a bunch of candy, you know, something fun. Yeah, you're right, dude. That would have been better. Yeah, I don't have free will. I can't just walk to the store. You know, I have a broken leg, Cody. Okay, well, what do you want, then? Ooh, you know my basketball girl downstairs? You should yeah. bring my basketball I'll go up here so I can shoot the basketball. Okay, I'll go get it. Yeah. You know, bringing someone a flower is actually a great way for them to actually feel better. Yeah, it might relieve their stress. It might actually make them feel better. Yeah, if you bring flowers to your friends or your family, they will appreciate that and they will love it very much. Uh-huh. Yeah, flowers make everyone feel better rather than feeling sick or feeling mad or feeling anything else at all. Flowers can actually help them, or anything else at all, than flowers, guys. Yeah, I like someone bring, to bring me flowers, and that would actually make me feel better. It would actually solve the mood that I am having right now, rather than having a bad day or something like that. Does flowers make you feel better, everyone? Write down in the comments if it does. Eh, eh. All right, dude, where do you want it? Can you move it a little bit more to the right, please? Oh, sure, dude. That's left, I said right. My bad, dude, God. Can you move it more to the right? All right, all right, I'm moving it. Did you even move it? Yes, I just moved it. Well, push it more. All right, I'm pushing, I'm pushing. More. Okay, now it's sideways. You can't possibly think I'm going to play with it if it's sideways. <gasps> all right, is this good? The couch is blocking it. I'd rather be sideways at this point. You know what? I'm going home, dude. God. What? Going home? Wow, Cody, did you hear that? He's going home, like walking home with his legs. And mine's broken, so I can't walk anywhere. Well, is there anything I can do, Junior? Can you move the goal for me? Uh, no, I think it's fine where it is. Well, can you at least pass me the ball? Yeah, sure. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, oh, my leg! Oh, the pain! I think you just broke it three more places! Jim, Junior! Oh, my God! Oh! Oh, God, the doctor! Shut me! Baby. Junior, uh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Can you hand me the ball like a normal person? We're not cavemen. Yeah, yeah, okay. Here you go. Okay, I'm gonna make the shot. Can you get the ball for me again? No, Junior, how about we just do something else? Uh, ooh, can you give me a back rub? Oh, yeah, I can do that. Oh, wait, how about, how about Ken gives me a back rub? Uh, really? Yeah, he has big muscular arms. I bet his back rubs are amazing. Okay. Oh, oh man, Cody, this back rub from Ken is so amazing. It doesn't mean anything, right, Ken? Oh, my God, his fingers are so magical, the way he's rubbing me. Oh, wait, Ken, what are you doing? I didn't say massage my butt. Okay, that's it. Ken, can I speak to you in the kitchen, please? Hey! Oh, my friends just abandoned me when my leg's broken. Junior, Junior, Junior! Oh, man, I came as soon as I got a commercial break. Chef Pippi told me you broke your leg. How did it happen? Please tell me everything. Um, well, I was on the jump. Oh, you poor baby! It sounds like it hurts! Oh. I should have been a better father! Oh, ho, ho, ho. What do you need? If you need anything, I'll get it for you, son. Oh, anything? Well, I asked. Oh, that sounds like a lot of stuff! Oh, you know what? I got the perfect thing. Here you go! Ow! Oh, my bad, son. I'm sorry. Let me move it. Oh, there you go. Just hit this, and then Shepard will bring you anything you need. Wait, anything I need? Yeah, anything. I'm gonna go back and watch my TV shows, okay? Okay. Anything I need. Yeah, Ken, I just didn't appreciate the way you were putting your hands on Junior, and I just have to know that it didn't mean anything. Really? You mean it? Now come here, you big hunk of man! Cody, what the hell's wrong with you? Uh, nothing. God, it's so weird. Shepard! Hey, what's that noise coming from? Uh.
It's my horn shed, PP. Junior, where did you get a horn from? My dad gave it to me. He said, whenever I need something to squeeze his horn in, you'll show up. Can you just call my name like you do every day? Well, what if you don't hear me call your name? Junior, you scream my name to the top of your lungs every day. I hear you call my name. Well, look, it worked. You came. Okay, so what do you want? Nothing. What? I was just testing it out. So, so you're just testing it out? Yeah, I just wanted to see if it would work. I came all the way up here for you to test it out? Well, look, it worked. I know it works, so I know to use it when I need something. Look, only call me if you need something for real. Okay. What do you want, Junior? I don't know where the remote is, and I want to watch TV. <laughs> Tell me everything you need right now. Uh, the remote? No, ugh. Here, here's the remote. Are you happy? Are, yes. are, are you satisfied? I don't need anything else. I just want to watch TV. God, thank you. Junior, I was two feet away. Listen, I need ice cream. Ice cream? Yeah, my leg said he wants ice cream. Oh, what kind of ice cream? What, what kind of ice cream do you want, leg? What's that? What? Your leg can talk. Yeah, he's talking. Shh. Ch chunky monkey? Is that even a f Is Chunky monkey a flavor? I don't know. Oh, well, my leg wants chunky monkey ice cream, so can you please give me some chunky monkey ice cream? Up, 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 up. What do you want, Junior? With a spoon, not a fork. Of course I will get it with a spoon! Oh, great. He's gonna treat Shepi like his butler. Oh, no. You, you see that, guys? I don't want that happening to me. Like someone honking their horn for me to give them anything they want. Like they want me to run to the store, go get them some. Or get something from the kitchen or anything else at all. Like their phone, their remote, their juice, their snack, or their dinner. Like, I don't want that doing that every freaking day until I freaking lose it. I don't want that happening to me and I don't want that happening to you, everyone. Yeah, you do not want to end up like this. If you guys already end up like this, then I feel bad for you. And I'm going to feel bad for Chef PP if this keeps up. I mean, this did happen to remake, and I'm gonna feel bad for him right now. All right, you little crybaby, here's your chunky monkey ice cream. Oh man, I can't wait to eat this w banana ice cream. What? I didn't know it was banana flavored. Junior, it says monkey on it. I got what you wanted. Ew! I wanted chocolate ice cream, not banana ice cream. You should have known it would have bananas in it if it has monkey on it. Well, no, no, no. I thought since it was called chunky monkey that the chunky word meant fat people because fat people like chocolate. So obviously I thought it was like chocolate with like banana pieces, not banana with chocolate pieces. So what do you want me to do, Junior? I want you to call the company and tell them to change the name to Banana Monkey Ice Cream so I would know it's banana ice cream next time. Junior, I'm not about to call the company over some stupid ice cream. Eat your damn ice cream and uh, leave me alone. I don't, I'm don't. i not going to like it. You will like it, all right? What do you want, Junior? Where's the spoon? This spoon's right here. Just look. Okay. God. I'm going to try it, but I bet I'm going to hate it. You'll love it. Uh, Oh man, that chunky monkey hit the spot. I am one chunky monkey. Oh, oh, ah, ah. <laughs> what do you want, Junior? That chunky monkey was delicious, Chef Pee Pee. Oh, I thought you didn't like your ice cream. I thought you didn't like chunky monkey. Well, I mean, I don't, but I ate it anyway because it wasn't chocolate, but it was good. What do you want? Um, can you give me a coloring book? A coloring book? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. I have to go all the way to a store to get a coloring book, Junior. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that you can go wherever you want because you don't have a broken leg. I'm so sorry. Oh. You know what? Shut up. I'm going to get your stupid coloring book. All right, Junior. Here's your stupid coloring book. Wow. Look at Elmo and his friends all at the beach on their non-broken legs. I wish I could go to the beach, but my leg is broken. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you have everything you need? Yeah. Thank you. No. What, Junior? What? Did you get crayons? Crayons? Crayons, Junior? I'm not going back to that store for some stupid crayons. Well, it's your fault that you bought a coloring book without crayons. Did the lady at the register go, uh, sir, do you need any crayons with your coloring book? And you went, duh, 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 I'm stupid. I, oh, how is he supposed to color without crayons? I'm not going to get him crayons. Junior, just imagine the colors. You already know what colors they're supposed to be. Look at the cover of this. That sounds racist. Get me crayon shape if you're I'm telling my dad. <laughs> All right, Junior. Oh, my leg, Chef Pee Pee, and you dropped them. Jesus Christ. Sorry. Look, I went to the store. I got your stupid crayons. I got 120 of them. Woohoo! Go crazy. That's a lot of colors to choose from, Chef Pee Pee. I don't know if I can decide on all these colors. You better get to choose them, boy. Okay, I'll color. Wow, what a dick. And also, you're calling him a racist? Bro, fuck you. I did not forget the OSML how many times you keep saying the M word and then all of a sudden you literally get your ass kicked. That's what I like about it. Yeah.
Julian gets ass kicked for keep saying the fucking N word. Yeah, that's you get you fucking racist. You really are racist yourself. Seriously, you even said it in front of Joseph. Comment down below if everyone knows that Junior keeps saying the N word and he's a racist, and we all know that. All right, Junior, I'm just coming in here to check on you because I'm, I'm about to go to sleep. I'm just making sure you don't need anything else because once I go to sleep, I'm not getting back up. So, do you need anything? Look at my coloring, Chevy B. Is it good? No. Well, why? Cookie Monster isn't orange, he's blue. Blue? That's dumb, I didn't know you was blue. You destroyed the book, I went all the way to that store to get that stupid book. Well, I didn't know Cookie Monster was blue, that's dumb. And, and plus, there's so many colors to choose from, I got so confused. How do you not know Cookie Monster is blue? Uh, I don't know, it's dumb. What, do you need anything else, Junior? Huh. Oh yeah, I need one more thing before you go to bed. <laughs> Shit, baby! I haven't slept in three weeks. What could you possibly need, Junior? Well, I finally want some Hawaiian punch, so can you get me a cup for that? A cup? Yeah. <sighs> hey, kid. But, Doctor, what are you doing here? Oh, I'm just here to tell you your leg's probably healed by now, so you can finally take off that cast and start walking around. Healed? No, can you lie and say that my leg is, like, broken even more so that so I can have it on for, like, another month? What? No, why? Because everyone's been giving me everything that I want. They've been giving me everything I need. W wait a minute. Didn't I tell you not to be a dick? No. Yeah, yeah, I think I did. Hold on, let's rewind. Wait, really? People do whatever I say? Yeah, I mean, don't take advantage of it. You know, don't be a dick, but yeah. Yeah, see, I said that. Well, well, well come on! I love everything being brought to me. Look, look, I got video games. I got I got all the snacks I want. Ooh, chunky monkey ice cream. I like that. Okay, kid, I'll tell you what. I won't tell anybody else, but you should really tell them your leg's healed. That's dumb. Uh, I'm junior, I got your stupid cup. Was that the doctor I just saw in here? Yes, the doctor came by. He x-rayed my leg to see if it was healed. And bad news. W what? Yeah, he said my leg is broken in three more places because people didn't bring me enough stuff. Three more places? Yeah, so he said that my leg's gonna be broken for another month. What? Junior, I can't do this for another month! Chef baby! I need a straw! <sighs> Junior, it's been two more weeks. What could you possibly need? Well, I'm getting tired of watching Paul Blart Mall Cop, so can you go get me Paul Blart Mall Cop 2 on DVD? <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? You really had him wasting your time taking care of you for the past five weeks? Are you kidding me right now? You are your damn mind. Seriously, guys, if I was injured, I would actually tell him to heal. I healed up. So they wanted to take care of me anymore because I'm healed and I'm better. And I would not treat them like dicks. I would not. I would treat them like respect. And that's what we all deserve, and that's what they deserve, like our friends and family who taking care of us, who care about us. Like, come on, we can't treat them like this. But it's okay, guys, it's okay. I'm about to get ready to see the end day because this is what he got what he deserves in the end. And I can't wait to see it, guys, because he's about to get what's coming to him. Hey, Junior. Hey, dude. Oh, hey, guys. Is your leg still broken? Unfortunately, yes. The doctor came two weeks ago to see if it healed. And he said that it could take another month to heal because it was even more broken than he's ever seen. And right before you guys got here, I heard another snap. So it could be a few more months. Oh, that's too bad, Junior. Why'd you guys come over? To give me more free stuff? Or to move my basketball goal? No. No, we just had three tickets to go do something cool. What is it? We were going to meet Paul Blight. Mall Cop? Yeah, Mall Cop. I've been watching that movie like 20 times. I want to go, I want to go, I want to go. Wait, Junior, how are you standing right now? Oh, ow, 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 ow. See, that's how I keep breaking it over and over. I keep forgetting it's broken. Oh, but guys, I totally want to go. And I got a wheelchair, so you guys can wheel me there. Oh, sorry, Junior. It's not wheelchair accessible. It's at the top of the Rocky stairs in Philadelphia, and he did that so that he can run up the stairs and go, <laughs> I need a candy bar. You know, because he's fat. Oh, well, well, guys, I really want to go. Ooh, maybe Chef Pee can carry me up the steps. Well, maybe. I mean, if you can go, meet us there. Okay, I'll meet you guys there. Uh, Chef Pee <laughs> Oh, I'm so sorry, Junior. I couldn't find Paul Blart's Mall Cop 2 on DVD anywhere. Apparently, they burnt every copy because it was so bad. It's horrible. Hey, that, that, that doesn't matter, Chef PB. I need you to take me to Philadelphia and carry me up the Rocky Steps so I can meet Paul Blart Mall Cop. No, Junior. We can't go to Philadelphia. You have a broken leg. But, but, but I have a wheelchair and you can carry me. No, Junior. I'm not carrying you anywhere. The doctor said you had to stay here and I'm not risking you breaking that leg anymore. But 
Put shit, baby. All my friends are going. I want to go. I'm sorry. If you, if this wasn't broken, you could go. Wait, wait. So if my leg wasn't broken, I could go? Yeah. All right, Chef, baby, I have something to tell you. What? When the doctor was here two weeks ago, he said my leg wasn't broken anymore. And he said that, you know, to take my cast off. But I said I wanted my, to lie and say my leg was still broken, so you keep giving me free stuff. So can I go? What? Yeah, like, so can I go? My leg's not broken anymore. Junior! Ow, 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 my leg hurts again for real. Well, that's because your leg is broken again for real. Chef, baby, why'd you have to break my leg? Oh, I don't know. Doing stuff for someone that doesn't need it for five weeks straight really pisses me off. Yeah, and I gotta go meet Paul Blard Mall Cop. I gotta make him eat a dirty lollipop. Oh, no, I wanna go. Oh, I'm sorry, Chef, baby, for lying. Yeah, you should be. Can you go give me some ch- No! You see that? That's what the fuck he deserves. Yeah, karma, Junior. This is what you get. This is what happens when you make everyone's life a living hell. You get karma. And that's what you deserve. It's the karma. Uh-huh. Yeah, I don't want this to happen to me. And I don't want that to happen to you, everyone else out who is watching this video. Yeah, you do not want to experience karma. Yeah, karma's going to be the worst. Like, if you see someone get hurt, you're going to get hurt too. Yeah. I would not want to do... I would not want to go into that. No, I don't. But anyway, I hope everyone enjoyed this video very much. Because I guess I like the part in the end when Julie got what he deserves. And that happens to be another broken leg. Because that's what he deserves. Like, I enjoyed the rest of the video of how much he's been a complete dick. Seriously. Like, he got everything he wanted. I mean, absolutely anything. And he's calling Chef Pee Pee like he is his butler. Like, come on. Like, I didn't like that. I'm not sure this was a good video at all, but... Well, let's just say, um, yeah, I guess this was a good video. But it, it's not a great video, but it is a good video. I hope all you agree with me. If you guys think this wasn't a good video, it's okay. It's okay to admit it. Yeah, I did not enjoy it, the rest of them at all. But anyway, I was really glad to react, alright? So, I'll be seeing everyone in the next video by SML. But till then, everyone had a nice day out there. And I'll be, see you, I, I'll be seeing you all later. So, peace out. Stay pro. Wait, everyone. Like, comment, and subscribe.